Hi there, this is Catherine. Thanks you for listening to my SEO Tips micro podcast. So before we get into today's SEO tip, I just wanted to share with you the ways you can support the podcast if you're enjoying all the tips and finding them useful. So you can send me a donation at buymeacoffee.com slash Catherine W. Ong, O-N-G. And that's Catherine with a K. Any and all levels of donation are appreciated. It will help me offset the cost of producing the podcast. So that's buymeacoffee.com slash K-A-T-H-E-R-I-N-E-W-O-N-G. I'd also encourage you to subscribe to our email list to make sure you're not missing any future episodes or any other news about the SEO Tips podcast. And to do that, you'd go to wostrategies.com slash newsletter. Okay, on with today's tip. Did you know that fast pages were, will now be labeled as fast in Android search? Hello, thanks for listening to SEO Tips today. So Google just announced on the Chromium blog that Chrome 85 beta will begin to use the Web Core Vitals measurement to highlight faster loading pages in Android search. They're starting out by labeling fast links. It's via this context menu on Chrome for Android. Um, however, once this is all rolled out, all Chrome users will see labeling if they have the light mode or make searches and browsing better turned on in Chrome. So as I had mentioned before, this labeling is based on the core web vitals metric that's used to quantify key aspects of a user experience as experienced by real Chrome users. The Chrome web core vitals is going to be a ranking factor in 2021, so it should be on your radar anyway. And the metrics measure loading time, mobile responsiveness, and whether the content shifts as it loads. So Google is using these metrics as a way to sort of create a, a new bar for good mobile user experience. Now this fast link is gonna be shown when users on an Android phone are clicking and holding a link. Um, and I've got a screenshot on my website about what exactly it looks like. Um, but ultimately, if you're not sure what your core web vital metrics are today, you should start measuring. Um, there are a variety of ways to get started with the measurement. The metrics are now in Core Chrome's Lighthouse. They're in DevTools, Third Page Speed Insights. They're actually in Google Search Console. Um, and if you crawl with Screaming Frog, you can use the Page Speed API to pull through the, through those metrics. There's also a Google Data Studio Chrome UX or Crux dashboard. You can just Google it um, to pull through those metrics as well. So that's your tip for today. If you're not currently measuring your Core Web Vitals metrics, you should. Thanks for listening. Come on back tomorrow for another SEO tip.